Hello everyone, Prey Scooter here, bringing you our Super Mario RPG Legend of Seven Stars for the Super Nintendo. Last episode, we went through Star Hill and saw the wishes of everyone in the world, most importantly, Luigi's wish. And this episode, we're going to go to Seaside Town. Nice sea shanty they got going on here. So, sorry, I'm just get, kind of digging the music right now. I do enjoy this music a bit, quite a bit. So let's go ahead and go to some of the shops and see what they got around here, huh? Hey there. A star has fallen into the sea. The pirate, probably. Yes. I mean, that man, uh, Jonathan Jones, probably has it. He is nasty. Can I buy stuff from you people? Oh, you're weird. Can, can I buy stuff from you? There's a... Okay, well, I can't buy anything there. That's weird. Let's try here. Hey, buddy. What are you doing? Huh. How did you know? Jump into whirlpools. I have no idea what you're talking about. Village Elder, huh? Well, let's go see him a little bit. They keep spinning and spinning. Oh. That's probably the spawn of one of my favorite You're the Man Now dog things. Uh, what's in here? Hi. No, I didn't want to leave. Can I talk to you? So you get supplies at Mooko Cookie. Huh. Well, actually, this isn't a bad place because they sell some of the best uh, used items in the game. Uh, those of you familiar with Earthbound, it's kind of like the bottle rockets. But fright bombs, fire bombs, ice bombs. Wouldn't you bad to have an ice bomb for Ma for Mallow just because he doesn't have his ice spell as of yet? But we'll leave that. Uh, sell weapons. I don't have anything to sell. Sell items. Don't have anything to sell there either. Well, that's unfortunate. And sorry, I've got a bad itch here. There we go. Well, thank you for your patronage. Dot, dot, dot. And in this middle house here. Or no, the same one. Sorry, I'm thinking of something else down the road. Hello. I, well, hey, someone's in there. Someone's in there. Mayor, you have someone in your house. Finally, it took you long enough. I'm the elder of this village. I got to my exalted station in life by pleasing my superiors, which is something I do well. A star has fallen into the ocean. I need it for a certain purpose. What, like Hanky Panky? You must find it for me. Okay. And up here, this is actually what all the frog coins are for. This guy up here. Hello. Yo, Mario, alright? Do you remember me? We met a tadpole plum and I was still a tadpole. Tadpole, yes. I've graduated from Fuckusis' school and now I'm searching for the meaning of life. 42. It's been so quiet around here. It's almost scary. Is, is something going on? It probably doesn't concern me, but if you have any frog coins, I've got some neat items to sell. And that he does! 16 frog coins, and we're going to need quite a bit more. I think I'm missing a few, but... Oh shoot, I didn't want to buy that. I bought a Sia! See, well, then I bought C and I'll hang on to it for a bit. Basically, let you escape from any battle at any time. Period. Exclamation point. Earlier times lets you restart a battle. Um, those of you lucky uh, watch happen to be watching Lucky with me. Basically, kind of like the reach high clocks in Bowser's Inside Story. Restart the battle from 1.1. Experience booster. 
Doesn't really give any stats, but as you see there, it doubles your experience. It's kind of it's better than experience share. Basically, you get this somebody in your back row, and they'll get the same experience as somebody that's not that. Or they'll get give this to somebody that's not fighting, and they'll get the same experience as someone that is fighting. Coin trick that was pretty obvious. Doubles your coins. Scrooge ring. Those of you that are having that, those of you that want to do kind of a magic type run, this is the item you're going to want to get. Cuts FP use in half. Basically, every time you're in a battle. Um, what is it? Uh, healing Rain will cost 1 FP. Thunder, 1 FP. Jump, 1 FP. I think it rounds down from if it, I think it rounds down if there's half amounts, but I'm not too sure. I never, I've never gotten to use this myself. Gimme see ya. So yeah, we have a see ya. Which, like I said, allows you to run for battles, and... Let's actually use one of these flower tabs quick. And let's use up our last mushroom on Mallow, because I don't think we'll be needing that anymore. And actually, I, I could have foregone that, but... <sighs> Princess, how about you come up here? Or no, you still only have armor. We'll show off the princess in time, but for now, she's going to be waiting right there. Let's look around the town see what else we got. What's up here? Well... This is pointless. Whatever. <clears throat> to the sea! Alrighty. So to the sea we go. Now the sea, it, it's kind of hit or miss for me. Cause just because of the mechanics they do use, but for things that you can't do. Hi. Been a while since we have people here. <clears throat> ah, yes, and we get some new items now. <clears throat> the hurly gloves here is are actually not quite as strong as the chain chop, oddly enough. Or I'll actually have to test that to make sure. But I've got money to spare. Super hammer. Don't buy this if you have the masher. This is actually weaker than the masher. Handgun. We're gonna want that. You already have. Wait, we have two hand. Oh. Uh, I messed up a bit. So now we have two handguns. Because they messed up. Let's see. Oh, yeah, his attack power does go up. We'll actually hang on to the chomp. Because there's a rumor that I've heard going around that the chomp can actually end up becoming Bowser. Almost as strong as Bowser's best weapon if you hang on to it. <coughs> But for now, we're going to use the Hurley Gloves, which is actually hilarious for what it does. Let's see. More armor. More armor. <clears throat> Bowser actually does not get get an, uh, a bit of armor here. Oh, she comes with a polka dress, so she does have armor. And Slap Glove. I didn't even notice. Oh, well. Let's give her... Let's give her an antidote pin so she can have that at the very least. Oh. The ship sank into the brain sea because of giant squid. Oh, great. Giant squids. I've seen enough anime to know where this is going to go. Sell weaponry. Sell a handgun. Sell all those. Okay, now something I'm going to tell you about. This B-Town Bring is actually for a hidden item that you'll get later on. Actually, wait, do we have that item right now? No, we don't. How much does the sea sell for? Five. Great. Huh. There's some emergency money hiding around here. Alright, anyway. I don't want anything. Let me leave. God damn, it's like Pokemon Centers. Anyway. <clears throat> Let's actually go ahead and switch Peach into the party. Or Toadstool. Peach Toadstool, basically the same person at this point. <laughs> now, let's come back to those. But basically, Peach or er, Peach slash Toadstool is, by definition, the White Mage. <coughs> Excuse me. She'll have all healing spells. It's really all she'll boast in. But 
She will get a, an offensive spell later on, so keep that in mind. Now we're actually going to go ahead and get rid of all these guys here, because there's a star in here. Get rid of as many as you can, because this is a lot of free experience. And I'll try and save one of these guys for demonstration first a little bit. Level 10 for Toadstool. And I think she gets eight, a lot of HP. Yeah, that's a lot of HP. Nine. Bowser, what do you get? What am I missing? Does he not get a bonus this level? Interesting. Well, power it is. <clears throat> so. Let's go ahead and fight one of these uh, star things. Now the now the enemies here are rather interesting because th this is where it's going to start getting to the point where enemies can only be damaged by one certain thing, and otherwise they take almost no damage by others. But we're going to start off here with a Zeo Star. Zeo Star has 90 HP, 75 attack, 60 defense. 20 magical attack, 20 magical defense, strong to nothing, weak to fire, 10 experience, 3 coins, and chance of dropping mushrooms. And the other enemy is a Leuco. Leuco? Leuco? I don't know how I don't know how you would say that. I want to say Leuco. These guys are, are ones you're gonna to want to worry about though. They have 220 HP. 20, or 65 attack, 50 defense, 42 magical attack, 60 magical defense. They are strong to they are strong to thunder, weak to fire, 20 experience, 3 coins, and they can drop either a mid mushroom or a honey syrup. So let's go ahead and show who's boss. Not like that, Mario. Now Peach, like I said, she's the white mage. She has therapy, which is one healing for one person, and group hug, which is healing for the whole party. But because she doesn't really have any attacks, we're gonna go ahead and let her fight stuff. Um, oh. Using recover, sorry. Now, the timing for Peach slap attack is basically when her hand comes on the back route, you know, hit A again, she'll slap it forward again, so. Now, the Hurley Gloves, I love this. Press A now. <laughs> you... You did not see that wrong. Bowser just chucked Mario as a projectile. Oh crap. Ouch. Okay. The princess is not a punching doll. Or a punching dummy. There. I'm getting the timing so wrong. Yes, do your dance. Do recover. So let's go ahead and do group hug. Now, group hug, I'm trying to remember the timing. Is it... Uh, I forget what the timing is. Yeah, Bowser, you show him your power. Bowser doesn't take lightning bolts very well, you know. Actually, he took a bell better than Peach did. And I can't... That's closer. I'm having trouble remembering the timing for... Uh, Mario's Master Attack. I never was good at the hammers. I don't know why. There he goes. HP Max. Ouch. Much better. I'm getting it back down again. Finish it up, Mar uh, Bowser. <laughs> Mario is bullet. And Mario reaches level 10 for that. I learned Super Flame. Basically, a fire, a fire attack that can hit everyone on the field, I think. No, that's the last one, sorry. Mario gets HP? Yeah, he gets HP. Not a lot, but he gets HP. And Mallow reaches level 10. Learn Shucker. Single target uh, thunder, thunder attack. And once again, HP. Alrighty. 
oops I think I missed it yeah there's a little entry here that you can go back here to get these items that we're hiding full health flower tab frog coin I always miss that for some reason now this part gets you a little bit of a tutorial on how water works uh, you can jump out here but normally if you're near land you press B you'll jump out but here, uh, go into a whirlpool, you go to the sea floor, it's just like uh, Super Mario Brothers, you know, except while well, you press B to jump, you kind of move slower, like you should in water, and you don't really swim. Uh, here, if you see little bubbles going up like that, that means it's an updraft whirlpool. You actually go upwards towards the top of water. Here you get a max mushroom. Nice little item, it's a nice item for you to hang on to for later. Uh, I like this. Just nice and calm out here. Now we'll probably see a lot of these guys in the in actual levels, but I'm gonna go ahead and fight one right now. Oh good, they all lined up very nice for me. As you can obviously see there, these guys are called bloobers. Bloober. Hmm. Must be them right here. Sorry, the the anybody that has, has them listed incorrectly. Bloobers, they have 130 HP, 80 attack, 36 defense, 21 magical attack, 16 magical defense, strong to nothing, weak to fire and thunder, 12 12 experience, zero coins, and they give you no items. Beat them for their insolence. Lucky. Man, even Peach. Now. Uh, shortly after they pop up is when you're going to want to press A. Basically, as they turn onto their backs. Sir, I don't care for you. Bowser doesn't care for you, I should say. So. Uh, double experience. No thanks. So that's those guys. Oops, I went to an updraft. Let's go down. And we're actually going to go in here. Because in here... Is the start of the next level. Page from a travel log. We're done for. A giant squid just got a hold of us. The ship's going down fast. Uh, I don't know what kind of accent that was. But I thank you all for watching this episode of Let's Play Super Mario RPG. Let's go to 7 stars. Tune in next time when we'll go ahead and explore this boat. This exact boat that I'm jumping in. I'll see you in. I'll see you then.